Uganda, fondly known as the Pearl of Africa, is East Africa's second largest economic hub and in recent years has grown to attract business people from across the region. The first growing Kampala city is opening up towards the integration of the East African community, the hotel industry is upbeat, the infrastructure is growing, and the government is working towards an enabling business environment, one that has seen investors set their sights on available opportunities. One such business is Air Uganda. The airline has two flights daily between Nairobi and Entebbe and is set to launch a third one on the 30th of September. Nairobi and Tebe is East Africa's busiest route, currently dominated by Kenya Airways. And when Air Uganda, the Aga Khan-owned airline, touched down in 2007, they knew they were up for a challenge. So what are you doing different um, from what all the other airlines tried and probably failed? I, I think we're trying to... Um concentrate on just our local customers in East Africa on the uh, the routes that we know there's big demand for. So what are you doing to create a um, emotional connection with your you know first consumers so to speak? Um, well the, the main thing we're doing is we are visiting all of the companies in Kampala and Entebbe so many many of our uh, passengers come from companies both large and small um, and the travel agents also had to be reassured that we were going to survive. Now, Air Uganda seeks to position itself as the preferred airline for East Africa, but ironically, it first has to gain the confidence of the Ugandan citizens in this market where no private airline has managed to operate over three years. But with the East African community slowly coming into place, the airline sees a massive opportunity for it to exploit. I am Terry Ann Chabet reporting for Citizen Business in Kampala, Uganda.